Morning world. I just dropped the camera by accident as I was formatting the memory card. Seems to be still working. I hope. If not, it's going to be a very expensive lesson. Anyways, mum put this on the table here for me. It's just the empty box though, but it's just really cool. It's by Renstad. Renstad's the uh, head hunting firm, right? The, the... Look at that. It says Hong Kong MX Mooncakes and then there's a Stormtrooper logo on it. And on the back, it's Darth Vader. And then the box itself is also Darth Vader. Check it out! So nice! Wow! Way to go! And on the back of this, it says May the Randstad Force be with you. Oops. But yeah, look at that. Wow! The inside of the box is so nice. And then that's that. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. This just looks really cool. Probably use the box for something else. Check out the latest offering for Mini. Look at that interior. 6 speed manual gearbox. Nice leather finish for this. Leather upholstery. 1 horsepower. We are at Reflections at Bukit Chandu. Uh, this is where they fought the World War II thingy, where the Japanese actually fought upwards the hill. So this is the house, uh, where it was held by a Malay regiment. Pretty cool stuff. It's the map. This is Pasir Panjang Battle Diary. And then, oh this uh, actually the stuff. It's the bugle. Look, writings. <laughs> it's a cleaver. What is that? It's called a bomber compass. Ooh. Presume that's a siren? Yeah, it's an air raid siren. Interesting. And then, battle lot for Singapore. What if I press it once more? I don't think I'm going to it. Oh. It restarted. I'm bored. Next. <laughs> oh look, it's the Katya. It's not old school. It's like an ammo tin box at the back. Oh wait, it's not. It's not exactly an ammo tin box. It's a, uh, yeah. Battle for Pasir Panjang. Hey, check it out. This guy. POWs. Oh, there's a button to be pressed. If someone's gonna jump out, I will scream. Duration? Oh man. I can only wait like 10 seconds though. The, oh, the show will begin 15 seconds after the button is activated. Okay, no more. <laughs> this is actually quite clue, cool, cool. This is actually quite cool because they built the, the models and then it's a hologram projected on there. Oh, he too long. Check out a nice wall painting on the stairwell up the second floor. It's like the voxophones in. Um, where is it? <laughs> Check it out. Like different ones have different. Different voice Different clips from that clash, the hatred. And over here is a mirror from. Look at that. It's like an overview of the battle. And then it's actually on top. Cool though. Malay regiment officer's uniform. Malay regiment walking out dress. I like how they repurposed the whole house. It's all air conditioned though now. It's a bust here. And then, uh, ooh, look at that. It's weapons used. It's a Arisaka rifle. Meiji Sanjuhati. Ah, okay. It's a Japanese rifle. 
Lee Enfield. Ah, this is used by the Brits. I think the Malay reg Regiment used it also. Oh, look at that. It's a barrel gun. Vickers Mark 1, it's called. And I don't know, there seems to be a stopwatch there. Oh, that's the Bren! Play Call of Duty. <laughs> and of course, a motor. Anyway, fun fact back in World War II, my great grandfather was a motor sergeant helping the British forces against the Japanese. Um, the moment there was word of surrender, the British officers told him to GTFO and go back to the family. That's where he brought the family and they escaped to Indonesia. Well done. Cool though. And yeah, so that's a motor. Motors are where, in case you didn't know, you angle the, the gun from here and then you drop an artillery round inside here. You'll hit that at the bottom and then it will ignite the thing and the round would Essentially. Yeah, peach garden. For Sean's birthday. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. <laughs> 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 